Shady Teak Music, Unbiased LLC, The Crafted Mind. What's up? How you doing? All right. Jay Jack up in the building. Hey, baby. How you doing? Beverly Smith is here. Oh, my goodness. I'm so happy that you guys are coming here. Yeah. Oh, I see the body running. Okay. Everybody be nice to the bot today. And I am talking to the adults on the adult side at 755 Media. What's going on, Deborah Gary? That's my foe, huh? Elizabeth Brown, the 755 is here. Yes, thank you all for coming in. I'm asking that you please like and share this live out if you possibly can. I appreciate it. Listen, bam. The kids are here. Hey, yeah, all right. What's up, kids? Love you guys. Thank you for being in the building. Okay, so um, they're ready. Because they're going to... They, 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 Everybody is debating with me about this uh, 
this reference photo. Everyone is debating about the reference photo, okay? Let me tell y'all something. Let me tell y'all something right now. I am not finna sit up here and tell you guys that this thing is gonna be easy and it's not. Be quiet, ducks. Stop. Stop. Stop, ducks. Okay. I'm trying to tell you that this thing is going to be so cool and quick. Y'all gonna be like, what? It's over? Yeah, don't 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 get up and go to the bathroom because it may be maybe over before you know it. Okay. So um, let's see something here. I am trying to get out of this screen and into this screen. I'm not. Uh, there we go. I got X out of it. Sissy's here, everyone. Say hi, Sissy. Hey. Say hello to the children. Hello, okay. Say they're up in here. And y'all know this sooner or later, she's gonna come through with some of those silly, funny, happy, and giggly accessory jokes. Okay, so y'all, y'all get with it, get with it. It's all about fall today. A lot of us are experiencing fall <clears throat> in our states. And I know some of y'all are excited about it. Halloween is right around the corner for those that celebrate that. Um, I want you all to uh, be safe and enjoy. Also, uh, let's see. Can't write new documents, preset file. I don't understand what you're talking about. Oh, wait a minute. It left me. Okay, so what I'm trying to do is get my reference photo. Y'all see the canvas, but what you do not see is the photo that I usually use for you guys to um, to uh, paint off. Now, what I'm trying to tell y'all is that this this photo is is it looks like oh it's gonna be so hard, but it's not. Set up, set up, set up. Get ready, get ready. Get your water out. Oh, you need it just a little bit. Okay, I got more than what I need. I usually have it down here, but I got it up there. But you don't need a full cup. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Because when you run away from the sink with your cup of water, you can get around and slosh water in your belly. And so we don't want that, all right? So to get started, I had this canvas. These canvases were donated by Sonia Siegler and um, and the Best Uni Crew, okay? So adults and some fast Five media, if you do not know them, get to know them. They're wonderful people. So listen, this is a mishap. Last night, see, this is why you got 10K stuff. Look at that. I got a little puncture in there, okay? So I'm going to show you how to repair that, but not on this show because I want this painting to be uh, easy for you guys and quick. So uh, I'll show you at a later date. We're going to paint on it. With the, yeah, with the hole in it. It's going to be okay. I'm going to show you all the fantastic things to do to fix that, okay? So I think that I want this puncture hole to go to the bottom. So I'm going to put it to the bottom. I'm going to set it up on my easel like that. Get your easel out. Do you have a ruler? If you do not have a ruler, for will find you one. If you do not have one, you can get something, anything with a straight edge, okay? You don't necessarily need it, but I figure it might be easier for you. So make sure you go and get that, okay? Get out your, your palette and your paintbrushes, okay? All right, get your paintbrushes out, you guys. And... I just want to give a big shout out, a big thanks to the family called uh, channel called Kicking It with the Rooks and also Unbiased LLC, who donated you guys to the to the Just Kidding Fund, and they um they donated some paint brushes. So I'm gonna go get them so I can show you because I gotta go show you. I gotta go show you. Okay, so I'm just trying to get the paint the picture. To come up for you guys so hold on a second i don't want it's giving me a lot of trouble okay saying something wrong with the internet i don't understand why am i am i broadcasting right sissy yes, so i don't know i don't understand what's going on here let me just try one more time okay i'm gonna do that i want you guys to go ahead and get everything that you need these are the paint colors that you will need for this afternoon i want you to get it out yeah. hmm? shut up I'm still making a donation to the Just Kidding. Chuck, four corners. Oh, no, wait. You guys are acting out. Oh, oh no, wait. I got I to gotta show y'all something. I got to tell you something. When somebody makes a donation, I have to tell you something. So here we go. Oh, oh yeah. Super chat hit. And now we lit lit. Somebody made it rain. Come through, fam. Come through, fam. Come through. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you, 
Woo-hoo. We lit lit. Yeah, thank you, Four Corners. Look what Four Corners gave us, y'all. Yeah, he gave us some lit lit money. Yeah, so we can get us some more stuff. All right? Yeah, we always like to get more stuff from just kidding. Thank you so much, Four Corners. You're the bomb. I think this lighting is a little dark. I'm going to turn my light on, you guys. I am so ready. I'm so ready. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Thank you, Four Corners. I appreciate that. Oh, you guys are awesome over there at the 755 Media Channel. Kids, if you got a brown, burnt umber, y'all know it's my fave. Get it out. You're going to need it. Also, I want you to get, I want you to get some blue out. Yeah, let's get some blue. We're going to use every color that we have, basically. Let's get you some blue out, okay? I want you to get you some blue, and I also want you to get you some white. And I know you're probably saying, Auntie 755, why do you have mismatched paint? Uh, because no one sponsored me yet. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay. Good. Let's make it. Come on. Come on now. Let's keep going. All right, so get you some blue out and put that on your palette, you guys. Okay, so I'm still trying to work on the picture. That's what I really want. I want the picture, sissy. Let's see. Um, let's see. I'm almost there. I'm almost to getting it. And I'm so sorry. As a lot of you know that Auntie 755 has been under the weather lately, but I'm feeling a lot better today. And I always feel better when you guys come around because you get me excited. Oh. And what? It just make me happy. Big boy, Megan. Big boy. Mm -hmm. Big boy Prince. Mm -hmm. Prince by the big boy. Prince by the big boy. Is he at it again? He Oh no, okay. Wait, big boy, wait, 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 wait. I want to show you something. Wait, big boy, I gotta show you this. I gotta show you this. Well, wait a minute. It's my computer is really is okay. Hold on, hold on, big boy. Don't leave. Big boy, I want to say something. I want to say something. Wait, wait, I gotta tell you something. I gotta tell you something. Wait a minute, big boy, friends, Prince, my big boy. Because I know he always back at it again. For sure. He's always at it. Yeah, yeah. And if you guys need to know more about that, you gotta go over there and see Big Boy Prince. You gotta go over there and see. Four Corner Custom Products, Mobile, Alabama. Okay, let's go. All right, so my computer is really acting stank. What is it, doing? it won't let me. It won't let me get the picture for the kids. Like, will it print it out? Or yeah, I can't print it out. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get it. It's just acting real stank. Do I have to get ready? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. So anyway, wait. I got to show big boy something. Wait. 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 Wait, kids, wait, wait, wait. Everybody, wait. Listen, y'all want to know? Yeah, something just happened over there on the adult side. Yeah, yeah. They just happened on the adult side. So I just want to show Big Boy something. Big Boy, look. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. And now we lit lit. Somebody made it right. Come through, fam. Come through, Big Boy. Come through, Big Boy. Come through, Come through, Big Boy. Yeah, thank you. Look what Big Boy got us. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, yeah. What? Four Corners. Four Corners. We try to get the kids baby. Okay, now we don't care. The kids, they're going to have a lot of stuff in a minute. These adults keep acting up. Because the adults are what? They're lit lit. All right, come on, come on. Okay, wait, wait. One time for Four Corners. Okay, wait, I got to give y'all the dance and stuff. I got to give y'all the dance and stuff. Because I'm just acting out too much. Let me turn this camera this way. What's up, family? I know it's a little tilted. That's because, wait, I'm going to fix it. That's because I had it set up for the, oh, it don't matter. Let's go. Oh, yeah. And yeah. now we lit lit. Somebody made it right. Come through, fam. Come through, four Yeah. Somebody did they die. Thank you, 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 yeah. Yeah, we lit lit. We lit lit. Thank you so much. Look, kids, look what they did for us. We're gonna go. We're going shopping, kids. We got brushes. Oh, and, the, and our cameras had a hole in it. We gotta go get more cameras with, without the holes. And let's see what else we can get. We can get some rulers. Maybe I can put some rulers in y'all boxes this time. And we can, more. Huh? And more. And more what rulers? More. Somebody did it again. Auntie Cuddles. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Wait, we gotta do it again. Mm -hmm. There we go. Y'all ready? Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, here we go. Kids. Oh, we love the kids. Let's go. Hey. Oh, yeah. They're going crazy on that dog side for the kids. Now, if you're not making a donation, scoot over to the Just Kidding page and hit the thumbs up. Yeah, come on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just kidding, baby. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the kids is going wild. Okay, let's go. They love it. 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 They love
I like that. The kids love Big it too. Big boy. Who did it? Big boy. Big boy. Oh my God. Big boy Prince. You back at it again. Wait, I gotta start it again. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, the super chat here. Yeah. And now yeah. we live. Come on, kids, dance. Come on, kids, let's go. Yeah. Them dogs is acting out for the kids today. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. We lit lit. Thank you, you guys. Y'all awesome, man. Y'all acting out though. And I appreciate that, man. We kids, guess what? We're gonna go get some stuff, okay? I know what y'all want some stuff. We're gonna get every box gonna come with rulers now. We're gonna go out and grab a big bunch of those and maybe some more brushes. Well, up uh, by LLC and uh cook kicking it with the roots, donate the the paint brushes. So I love you guys, man. Thank you so much. Now I gotta get this. I gotta get this picture up so you guys can see how quick and how easy it's gonna be. I'm telling y'all, about an hour from now, you're gonna be like, Mommy, Daddy, Auntie Cuddles, look what I did. And it's quick. They're gonna be like, Ah, no way, no way. And I'm gonna be like, Yes, way. Just because we are not just kidding. We're just kidding. So y'all. Go ahead and do it. What Big Boy did again? Before you take off, because we know you busy and you working. When you ain't working, you bugging on the kids and making donations. Thank you, Big Boy. You hear what Sussie said, thank Big Boy? You. She said, thank you. Sissy, mm -hmm. I'm going to play it for you. And you can say it. No, you can play it for Big Boy. Play it for Big Boy? Play it for Big Boy. All right. Go, Big Boy Prince. Hey! Ah, oh, the super chat here. And now yeah. we lit lit. Somebody. Come through, fam. Come Thank you. Thank you. I don't even know what it is, but thank you. Okay, it's two dollars. Thank you so much. God bless you, man. Thank you so much. Y'all acting all over for the kids. Oh, let's go. Let's get into it. Let's go, fam. Let's go. Let's go, kids. Y'all got some paintbrushes. Okay, I know the adults is acting now. We don't care. Let them act out. This we don't care. Okay, we don't care. Back to the art. Yeah. Okay, but meanwhile, uh, share yeah. it out, y'all. Share it out. Share yes, it out, please. Yes, since he said share this out, please do. My God, please share this out, cause your girl is your girl is over here doing our best with the family. We yes, we we doing donations can support even more kids. Share it. Yeah, out. yeah, because I, I really want like to give out some for Christmas this year, and a lot of you guys are strapped for money. I get it, parents. Kids might not get it, but I get it. You know, so. That's a whole nother lie. But anyway, I want to give out a couple of art boxes for Christmas to, you know, somebody. I'm going to do a drawing. And, right, um, and then the kids can bring a friend. The kids can bring a friend. Right. Yeah, you know what? That might be that might be a great idea, Auntie, because, like, give a double box out. One for the one kid and one for their friend, sister, cousin, brother, neighbor, or classmate. How about this? Thank you, so. All right, so we'll do something like that. So, and the donations help. So I appreciate you guys. Let's get into it. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. Draw. Set up, set up, set up. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Auntie 755 is here. The wait is over. Just kidding. Are you ready? I'm ready. The just kidding kids are the best kids, baby. Yes, they are. Are you ready? Wait, and 
fingers too. We're paint slaves, we slain the paint, create our masterpiece. We're cracking jokes, we're stretching out. We do this every week. We paint real things and sometimes cartoons. Drop down our charts and meet at high noon. Other kids are outside, but we're in our zone. We just want to paint with Auntie 755 show. Okay, I see y'all just gonna keep on. Okay, let me get into this because if I don't get into this, y'all won't do it again. All right, go. Let's go. Uh, That's for creation. Hey, and now we thank you so much. Yeah, maybe I can get me to this time. I don't know, I know how to say it. Did it help me put out the scene? Okay, I don't know. Thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you, Casper. We lit lit. You lit lit. All y'all lit lit. Thank you so much. Good afternoon. I'm having a good time. Y'all got my heart beating fast. Now stop. No, no, don't stop. <laughs> okay, wait. No, back to the art. Cause I get silly. All right. So I just want to turn it this way. Then I want to point it down. I love you guys, man. Ooh, let me know when we get another one. I might get up and do a shimmy. <laughs> okay, let's go. All right, so I was trying to tell y'all, all the colors I saw are beautiful. Sissy, um, uh, a.k.a. Auntie Cuddles, she's going to point out what we need, all right? But while she does that, I want you guys to get out your white, like I was telling you, put a little bit on your canvas, I mean, on your palette, like so. Just squish a little bit in there, squish. You don't need a whole bunch of white, just a little bit, okay? All right, you see it? All right, so... Oh, yeah, we're going to get some more of these palettes because I like these. I got the little tiny itty bitty ones from the dollar store, but we need the bigger ones because the kids need something big to hold their little bitty hands, and the bigger kids need some bigger stuff, okay? So we're just going to put a little bit of blue on here. Can y'all see it? Just a little tiny bit. We don't need a lot, okay? And I also, if, do you guys have orange? I got some orange. Look, do you have orange? Well, I'm going to tell you how you can make some orange. All right. Let me show you how to make some orange. But I'm going to put mine out here like so. And then I'm going to show you all how we can make this color. It's going to be pretty easy. The camera is showing up a little yellowish. And that's okay. But it's really orange, orange. All right. So I want you to get some red out. Get you some red, babies. All right. See a little red at the top? Go grab you some. Don't need a lot. Just a little bit. Just a little tiny bit. And you might need some more, so it don't matter. Just put some out there because I'm guaranteeing you, all the fall colors is going to pop, okay? They're going to pop. You guys going to love this. Your parents are going to love this paint. This is one that if, if a grandma could take off or with, okay? I'm just letting you know. This is one painting that grandma could just be like, oh, I need that. She's going to be showing everybody, the Nana, the Gigi, whatever you call it. Anyway, it don't matter. Put you some yellow out there, baby. So I'm put your yellow out. Just put a little bit. And if you need more, I want you to go back and get it. Shout out to everybody who did Super Chats, man. Shout out to everybody to share me out on all platforms. And shout out to everybody on the, put me on the community tab today. And shout out to everybody that went over just hitting page and thumbs up from the, from the adult side. So now, this is what we were working with, okay? So I'm going to use... I'm going to use this brush because most of you guys have this brush. This is called the round brush. The round brush, okay? Now, you take your, this is your yellow. I want you to just take a little dab, just dab that red. 
just dab a little bit. See, just a little bit on the brush. And come over here and start mixing it in with your yellow. Mix it. Don't be afraid to mix it. Mix it. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. And drop it over here by that, yeah, that by that orange. See? See that? I got a bubble in it. Okay, let me bubble out. Yeah, see? It's easy. So, you, we don't care if you still got some orange on your breast. I want you to take your breast, and I just want you to start sweeping it in the sky like this. Yeah, that's cool. Now, once your, all the paint is off, dip your paint in water and tap it on the side of your cup so that all the excess water run off. Come in here and grab it some of this white and a little bit of that blue, too. Yeah, grab it. We don't care. Yeah, put it on there. Yeah, just start pushing it in, pushing it in. Scrub it in, you guys. Scrub it all in. Yeah, yeah. This is how easy this is going to be. I'm trying to take. I just grabbed some bunch of more white and put that up there. Just push it in. Don't forget to top these sides. We want it to look good, you guys. So go ahead and squish it around. Thank you so much, everybody. Y'all, I'm still thinking about the super chats because you guys made me feel so good. Casper Creation, Four Corners Plus of Products. Big boy prints. You guys, did I miss anybody? I miss anybody? Did I miss anybody? See, I can't see my chat, so I'm just going on pretty much what my sissy tells me. So, oh my goodness, thank you so much. Yes. So, we're just switching it around. Uh, I feel like I need another light on for you guys. I don't know. Uh, I think, yeah, okay, so we'll get on that. So, just switch it side to side stroke. Go all the way. And listen, make sure, family, dump your breast. If your breast get dry, dump your breast in there. And just come back on the pattern and just start swishing. And evenly put this, um, these colors go side to side like this. Just side to side. See how it's time for one color to another color like that. Yeah, we don't care. We just going to do it. Because this is our sky, okay? And I know y'all probably looking at the picture that I put up and said, that is not a sky. Let me see. It's awful. No, that's fine, sis. She did a great job. Shout out to Accessories. She gave us a picture. Yay. All right. So she's proclaiming it's not the best picture. But I say it is. Because here and just kidding. Hi, Trina. We can fix it. Okay. We can make it all happen. It doesn't have to be clear. You guys just got to see what we paint. I'm going to grab me a piece of this tape. <laughs> Trina. Drina. Drina? We just received another donation. Hey, Drina, what's up? Drina, Drina's Haven 916. Yeah, Drina's Haven. I know who you're talking about. Yes, yeah, the girl. I have this big canvas white blank frames. I wish I could give them to you for painting. So she's going to email you details of it. Oh, wow. Yeah, we love that. We love gifts like that. We, I'm telling you, we need it. The kids will be so happy. We could do so much. But just that little bit of help that you all can offer. We really do appreciate it. Thank you so much, Drina. Drina Haven, y'all. Yeah. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the channel as far as for, like and subscribe to everybody's channel today. Let's go. So I'm just going to dig into this. Drina, so do you paint? Let us know. We like to know if you like to paint, honey. Because we are, we love people who paint. We paint all the time. Every Saturday at 12 high noon, Drina, did you know that? I know you do, honey. Yeah. So we just going to keep going, keep going. It, just, it might not seem like much. It might not. But it's there, you guys. Let me show you up close. It's there. See? Can you see the wetness? See it? Yeah, just keep going. Look, this is going to be so easy. And this, it just add a little bit of yellow maybe and a little bit of this. Just grab some white and some yellow. But we just want it to all shine through. And yeah, and so oh, wow. you can come down like this. And yeah, and this will be just fine. And just squish it in, you guys. Squish it in, squish it in. Slither it on and slather it on. Make sure your canvas is covered with paint, okay? That's the important thing. And you guys know how I feel about the sides. Just grab some and squish it on the sides up in here. And that's going to be so nice. Yeah, I'm trying to tell you that you're going to be the talk of the town. Your teacher, when you when you show your teacher, this is going to be so nice. Okay, wait, I'm going to just get some more white paint because I'm all off. 
You want some more? Get some more. Okay, get some more, get some more. And just put it on your palette. It could be right there where it was before, even if it's a little yellow in there. That, we don't don't mind. Just get some white. It's white. Always, always pronounce your T at the end of white. If I say white, give you a little white. Okay. And then just come up here and scrub it on and paint your canvas because we want it to look so pretty. Yeah, it's going to look so nice when you finish this. Scrub it on. What they say, sis? You was over there giggling. Not giggling. Gina said, Gina said, Gina? she loves painting and she's going to email some pictures and that she usually refurbishes and paints furniture and stuff. Oh, wow. Yeah. She also said that this is the only channel she allows her 14 year old to watch. Okay. Positive and motivation. Thank you so much. Hey, man, that's awesome. Thank you, Drina. Yeah, yes, thank you so much. We got to keep the kids uplifted. We got to keep the kids busy with the goodness. You know what I mean? And, and if, if this channel brings out for you, that's I'm, I'm meeting my goal. I'm meeting my goal. I'm going to grab some black, you guys. All right, so we're going to use a lot of black later, so I'm just going to put some in there. It don't matter. Well, uh, welcome in. I don't know what your 14-year-old name is, but we're just going to say Drina's son. Right? It's a son, right? She didn't say. Okay. So she said, baby. Okay. Well, we appreciate that. Please keep watching. Tell others. I'm trying to I'm trying to boost this up for the babies, y'all. I really am. I want them to be. Oh, oh, the, the art is going away. We need the art to stay. We need the art. Oh, well, let me show y'all what I'm doing. So I took some white and I got over here. I grabbed some of this white and I mixed it in with some of my black, not all of it. Because there's a road here. There's a path here. You see this path? So we want to do it. So it's like halfway. So what I'm going to tell you to do is flip your canvas upside down, right? But I'm going to do it because I had a picture. So if you had the picture, you could flip it upside down too. And then just go the same length as you see the road right here. See it? But don't forget to paint the bottom. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So paint your bottom, right? So... That's how you can do it, all right? And then once you flip it up, you already know where the road is going to begin. And you're just going to taper it off to the side. All right, so I'm going to go grab me some more of this paint, and I'm going to bring it here, and I'm going to just drag. And it don't have to be perfect. No path that's perfectly made. Stop acting like it's got to be perfectly made. It doesn't. So just go in there, and then you just squiggly line and squiggly line. Look, I'm trying to tell you it's going to be quick. Sissy. Hmm. Tad, time this now. What time is what time we getting started on this? Um, okay. I don't know, but it's twelve thirty six. It's twelve thirty six now. Mm -hmm. All right, that's cool. So we got we got a path going. All right, so I'm gonna drag it out just a little more, and I'm gonna just bring it over a little bit more too. You know why? Because this is an eight by ten, and this is like a ten by something. I think it's a ten by ten. All right, so I'm just gonna drag it over so that we have some road over there. And I'm just squiggly lining in. Now y'all like, wow, okay, we see a sky, we see a path. Okay, so we got other stuff to do. So now I just want to bring down, I'm just going to squish it, squish some of this gray up there. Yeah, I am. And I'm going to give a bunch of white, and I'm going to come in with it, and I'm going to squish it around. And I'm just going to bring this all the way down. Now, <laughs> you can use whatever colors you want, just make sure that pastel. When I mean pastel, I'm saying they're not dark colors. They got to be light colors like this. You see, there's some light colors. We don't want the dark. We want, this is called perspective, okay, you guys? So we want the colors to be light in the far away. If you notice, if you're driving down the road, just drive down. One day we're in the car, you guys are in the SUV with your parents or whomever, and they're driving. I want you to look far down the road. And, and I, I'm sure there might be a McDonald's sign. Okay, let's just use a McDonald's sign. And you look way down that point, way down that, way down that. The McDonald's sign is going to be this little. But the closer you get to that McDonald's sign, it's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. And then it's going to get so big, you got to look way up in the sky to just see it because it's so big. That's called perspective. When things are far away, they're very tiny. When they're closer up to you, they're bigger. So if you notice in this picture, all these trees are back in the back. And then these trees you would look at and say, 
Well, these trees, let me turn this up just a little bit, you guys. Sorry about that. Uh, it's going to be hard to get it out of here. But these, these trees, you're going to say, is probably closer than these trees. All right. And, and, and probably these trees are probably closer than these trees because they're farther away. But this tree right here, woohoo, this is one of the big Bob Ross trees, right? And it's closer. Okay. And it's older, it's bigger. And now, this might be about the same distance. For real, for real. But this tree, you can tell, is younger than this tree. But the idea is what I'm trying to tell you. You don't see the trees this big way back in there. They're little because they're farther away. So that's what I want your mind to think about, okay? <clears throat> All right. So now we're down here, and, and, and we pretty much got the sky going. So I want you guys to get into your orange, all right? Get into some orange. Did you get the brown out? Let's get that brown out, too. Yeah, yeah. Burnt umber or brown. And if you do not have brown, I want you to take you some blue and mix it with some red and mix it with some yellow and mix it with some black. And just mix up some stuff until you get your nice brown, okay? So now I got me some brown out. And I got a heck of a lot of it out. We're going to work with it because we got a tree and stuff to do, too. So I'm going to dip my paintbrush in water and smack off my extra water. 15 people in the chat over there on the on the um the uh, 755 side. Appreciate y'all. And I'm gonna grab this. I really want to get into my bigger brush, but for right now, let me turn this down just a little bit again. Guys, I'm sorry. I'm gonna keep I wanna keep I'm gonna keep doing it. <clears throat> Maybe I can move it side by side. Let's try that. So I don't want to keep moving this camera, you guys. All right, so. Since he had the time check, he had a time stamp. I got a ruler out, and I don't think I'm gonna need it. But we're gonna, if we do, we got one by the side. Yeah, I'm excited about going out and purchasing a bunch of rulers for all the kids to go in their boxes. And guess what? Free! Right, because we've got donations today. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Love the parents. Thank you so much, everybody. All right, so we got the path out. All right, so now I got brown on my brush. So I wanna come in. And I can see that there's a heel here. So I'm just going to draw the heel like this. I do. I want to put that heel in there like that. Yeah. All right. So I like that part. So, yeah. All right. So now what I can do is, let me switch my brush. I'm going to go bigger. Let's get out maybe an angle brush or a flat brush. If you have a flat brush, that would be cool. Or angle brush like this where it's nice and wide. Look at that. Nice and wide and flat. Yeah. Go ahead and dip that in some water. Why don't you? All right, why don't you do that? And then you can come in and you can add more brown in here. Now, while you add brown, I want you to grab some of this yellow and a little bit of white, too. I don't care what you grab. Just grab something and put it in here. We don't care what it is. It could have been blue. I don't care what it is. Yeah, I'm going to get some orange and pop it in there. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. That's just what I'm going to do. And I'm going to put that orange in there just why? Because we can. Okay, because we can. And I'm just going to scrub it all the way in like so. And I'm going to bring it all the way around that road, just right around in there. And I'm just going to put that in there like that. And now I'm going to leave it alone. Look! Look, y'all! Okay, we got a skyline, we got a path, and we got a little hill over here, right? All right. Ooh! Ooh! I want some green. Green. Anybody got some green? Uh, you better have some green. You got to have some green. Yeah. All right, so we're going to get some green. Green is a secondary color. You can use it by making blue and yellow together. I mean, I'm sorry. Yeah, blue and yellow together is going to give you green. So let's put some green out here if you don't have it. Go on and make sure you have some blue and yellow. We, yeah, we got some. So we're just going to take some out. And I want you guys to, like, maybe mix it with, um, let's say, pick a color. White. All right. So we'll mix it with a little bit of white. Get a little bit of red, in, I mean, uh, yellow in there, too. Just kind of dab your brush. Just dab your brush in there. We got some green going. Because, you guys, there is still greenness going on in the in this little park. It's a little green still happening. All right? So let's look at the picture. I see some green. It's going on over here. So we're just going to put a little bit in there. Maybe a little bit going to be at the bottom of the tree a little bit. Some over there like that, right? Okay, so that's cool. All right, so we're going to go back and get our orange 
and y'all don't mix it. Just grab it. Scoop it up, y'all. Scoop it up. And I want you to just start dabbing. And then you see a little green on your brush. Just dab. Just dab, you guys. Just go ahead and dab and dab. Yeah. You, you can put a little bit up here. It's okay. Just a little dabs here and there. Just a little dabs. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Everything is going to be just fine. Just do what I tell you. All right. So that's a lot of green. I want you to wipe your brush off, all right? Because we dumped the brush, right? I know. I know it look crazy. Cuddles is looking at me like, what is that? I don't care. Look, look, get this. Get this. Wipe it off. All right. Just wipe it off. Get your just kidding towel and wipe it off, right? All right. So now... Guys, don't rinse. Just dip your water. Just dip your brush in water and, and, and knock it off. Now, I want you guys, I want you guys to get some orange. Get some more orange. Because orange, it's a lot of orange in the fall coloring. It's a lot. So just get some. Now I want you to go side to side with this dabs, like, right? I want you to go side to side with your dabs, like so. And just go side to side like that. Don't stroke them down like that. Just go side to side. Make sure you get a lot of them in there, here, and there. It's all over the picture, okay? Just everywhere. Just dab, y'all. Just dab, dab. Not the kind of dab that Big Boy Prince is doing over at the Cowboy Gang. No, no, no. They're not this dab. You know, just dab. Just dab a little bit. Come on in here and just dab. We don't care. Oh, yeah, don't forget around the bottom of this tree right here. We're going to dab something in there. I just dab it all around, right? Oh, don't forget to paint the bottom. Mm -mm. Just pause. Paint the bottom. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, we're gonna make sure these bottoms look good. All right. Get on this side too, because I ain't do that side. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, just go ahead and finish it off. Well, you guys can do it. You're doing great. And you ain't even thinking about that hole in the canvas anymore. I know you're not. I know you're not. <laughs> no, and we're gonna get on the side too. Let me get some more orange over here. So why y'all dabbing? I have a joke for you. You have a joke for me? I did. And what about kids? It's for the kids. Oh, it's for the kids too. Okay, let's go. <laughs> we love jokes, y'all. Get ready. How are you supposed to talk in the library? How are you supposed to talk in the library? I know you got to be very quiet when you're in the library because people are concentrating. Mm -hmm. So I would say softly. Nope. What? With your insider, like si apple cider voice. Apple cider Insider. Insider. Oh, okay. That's enough. And we, we think Cuddles has had enough apple cider. You guys, so that's pretty cool. That was a good one, sister. That was a good one. Now, let's get to the exciting part, the trees. All right, so now that we got some stuff down there, I want to put some more yellow in there. Maybe some more white. Let me mix some white and orange together. White and orange. Oh, and a little green in there, too. We don't care. We don't care. Just dab, you guys. Just dab, just dab, just dab. Just dab. Keep dabbing. It's okay. I'm trying to tell y'all it's going to be all right. Just dab. Yeah, keep dabbing. I was going to get to these trees, but I want to put a little bit more. I just want to put a little bit more in the background. Just keep dabbing. Dab, dab, dab. It's okay if your dabs are bigger than the other dabs. Dab some more. Let's grab some more and dab some more, okay? We can go all the way up with it. Just a little bit. Yeah, fill it up in there. Get some dabs and that. Oh, I think we need some more of this red. We're not doing too much red. Let's mix some red and a little bit of this greenish, yellow, orange and stuff. We're going to start putting that in there, too. Yeah. What's going on now? What's happening, everybody? Talk to me. Talk to me, everybody. Talk to me. Marissa and Lena stopped by. Hey, Lena, baby, Marissa. What's up? I love them. They always come in and support yeah, such great. Yeah. 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 Hey, Tina. Oh, you guys. I went by Tina's. And she's over there. She's learned, she's learning to sing a song. And she's doing very well. And I'm so proud of her. Because she is not letting it stop her to do it online and show us that she can do this thing. And she is not letting it stop her. So congratulations to Tina doing the most over there with that voice. Get a girl. And who else you said come in with Tina? Deborah. Hey, Deborah. 400 is here, y'all. Get ready. You know she comes with the excitement. Yeah, she's always dancing around in the chat and stuff. So I'm going to get some more yellow. Welcome in, ladies. I appreciate y'all. And I don't care. I'm just going to put it on there. And so I got some more orange and some more yellow. Because this painting is going to require a lot of stuff. So I'm just going to keep on dabbing. 
And I'm not going to cover up the whole sky, you guys. I really ain't. So my sky is not going to be so much um, like this guy because I'm doing my own thing. But I am definitely just going to go but what I see. I'm going to dab on my sides as well. All different things. Do you guys see something happening here? I don't know if you can. I don't know if you guys are really paying attention. But I am dabbing and dabbing away. And I'm dabbing on top of other colors. And I'm just dabbing. And I'm dabbing. That's all you're doing. That's it. All you got to do is sit here. Listen to the voice and the sounds of whatever you want. I like to put on some shiny cheap music. Me personally. That's what I like to listen to when I paint. And you can listen to whatever you want. And you can just sit here and you can dab. And get, don't forget to add white in now. Okay, sometimes you got to add a little bit more white in there. So you can see we're running through painting, uh, pit, paint because painting, when you're painting multiple colors, you're going to go through a lot. So just add some whites in here and there, so to speak, in here and there. Grab you some more. Go on the side and add a little bit more white. And just go in with it. And the white is going to stretch the colors out a little bit. And that's fine. Just go ahead and put it in there. Okay. So just put your white in. And mostly at the top now. Okay. Don't, don't go too far down with it. But about halfway. About halfway is good. And so you're just going to add the white in. You guys see anything happening or no? Okay. I just want to know. Let me know if you guys start seeing something happening. And you just keep dabbing and dabbing and dabbing. Right? And even in the middle part here, because all of this is going to be filled up. So just keep dabbing and dabbing and dabbing with your brush. Don't stop. Yeah, you can take a break for a second, but don't stop. And don't give up, because this is going to be so nice. And if you see it all the way through to the end, Auntie Carmen would love for you. We're still working in white. We still got white. Auntie Carmen would love for you to email me, okay, and show me your painting. This one I got to see because so many people didn't think we could do it. When I'm telling them, we are just kidding, honey, and we can do anything we want. And that goes for life, too. I always tell you guys, you can do anything in life that you want to do. All you have to do is want to do it and find the tools to do it. And if you can't find the tools to do it on your own, you can always ask for help. There are people that will help you. Just kidding. Look at all the people that just helped us, and they sent us gifts. So we can go buy more things for our program, you know, for, for our boxes and everything. So I want, I want you guys to just fill this all up. You see how I'm doing? Okay? And just fill it all in. All right, so we got nice and nice white. Do y'all do y'all see anything starting to happen here? No, not really? Okay, that's fine. All right, that's fine. Get you some red on your brush. Maybe some more orange. And I want you guys to dab and dab. Yeah, just dab. Dab, dab, dab. And it's okay. Just do however you got to do it. And it's all right. It's going to be okay. It's going to be just fine. I just want you to know that this dabbing is going to pay off. So just keep dabbing, keep dabbing, and brush it in. Let's get these fall colors all around, all around, all around, okay? So I used to watch a man named Bob Ross when I was a little younger. And I'm going to watch Bob, and I'm going to get a lot of yellow this time. And I'm going to come in over the top of that, and I'm going to just keep dabbing and dabbing. So I used to watch Bob Ross, and he would paint with oil paints. Now, I I I have never painted a painting with oil paints. I played around with them, you know what I mean? But I've never, come on, dab on the ground too, y'all. Come on, don't forget down here. I have never painted a painting with oil paints, not once. But I would love to. Okay, and I think I would love to do it with you guys. I think that you guys would really, really, well, I think we would have a lot of fun. So let's plan for that one time in the future. Even if you don't have the oil paints, you could still come in and watch me paint with them and just, just see, how, see how I work with them and see if it's something that you would like to do in the future. But anyway, Bob Ross is a great, great artist. Uh, you see him on YouTube. He's very um, family-oriented, very friendly with, with everyone. Okay, everyone can view this guy. And and he's no longer with us, but his paintings are. And they're, and they're here forever. So I want you guys to go over 
check out Bob Ross. And a lot of your parents probably would know who I'm talking about. So I'm just painting my sides and I'm dabbing you guys, okay? See those pretty, pretty fall colors? Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. Maybe if you want to get a little blue in there, you can. Grab some blue in there. And grabbing that blue, it's going to mix with that orange and that yellow. It's color. It, it might, it's going to give you some green. It's going to give you some darker tree bark look. So don't worry about it. Just grabbing it. Maybe just add a little blue in there too, okay? Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Just dab, you guys. That's all we're doing today. Just dab and look at that. All right? So I'm trying to get that woodsy feel. So, yeah, we got a little bit of blue on our brush, and that's cool. Let's put a little bit of green on our brush too. And a little bit of this white. We're just going to mix these colors up. We're just going to keep dabbing. Keep dabbing. It's okay. Don't worry about it. It's fine. We're going to be all right. So, yeah, that's your, that's your homework for the week, you guys. I want you to go check out Bob Ross, and I want you to just watch a few of his shows, and I want you to get a feel for the oil painting, which is um, something that all artists should just at least try for once. And then we're going to come in, we're going to, we're going to paint with oils too, okay? We're going to do it because we can. We know we can. I'm going to get some of this burnt umber. I'm wetting my brush. I'm going to grab some more of this brown or burnt umber, whichever you have. And I'm going to mix it in with my white. And I'm getting this really light brown color. And I like it a lot. So while we got our, our angle brush here, okay, we got some paint on there. I want to go ahead and take my angle brush. I'm going to go right from, the, from this pathway, right? And I'm just going to streak it up like that, right? You guys can't see. Let me bring it over. The picture is cool, but the painting is, is going to be better. So I'm going to take this brown, and I'm, and I'm going to go somewhere else, and I'm going to streak it up like that. I'm going to come over here. I'm going to streak it up like that. Maybe over here. And it don't have to be a straight line. It could be, you can get some more darker brown on here. And this time I'm going to go just kind of crooked ways like that. And, 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 and way like that and maybe a another kind of crooked way like that and and, and this one I'm gonna go real I'm gonna press down harder and make my brush go wider and I'm just gonna take it all the way up like that wet your brush okay go ahead and wet your brush and, and get back into that brown again and, and now I got this kind of stuff I got all kind of colors on there I'm just gonna kind of scrape them off on the side and I'm gonna gather them back up again right I'm mixing them together. I'm mixing them together. Now, and, and I'm gonna take my angle brush again, and I'm gonna come over here, and I'm gonna pull this one up, and I'm just gonna bend it off to the side a little bit. You feel me? That's all I did. So I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight times I went up like that, right? So just keep it going. Keep going. Keep going. That and, is awesome. And go. You see it, sissy? I would have never thought to do it. That way. It's starting to come around, right? Heck yeah. All right. So then uh, a little bit bigger over here. It's okay if they touch other ones. We don't care. Take it all the way up to the top, okay? All right? When your brush get dry, wet it. Wet it. And then go back into your the little mixture you got. And do another one. Do another one right here. And don't have to be straight because trees do not grow straight up and down, right? All right? So I want to make sure that tree goes all the way up. Just make sure they go all the way up. And, 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 and you know me. I'm going to always come up here and do this so it... The tree of match, you know what I mean? You can do that later, you can do it now, it's okay. So now we got these trees going, you see? What are you guys seeing? Are you guys seeing anything happening here? Is Auntie Cuddles the only one that's seeing something? Let me know in the chat. All right, so um, kids, I just wanna tell you guys that anything is possible and we're just gonna keep making these little streaks like that. And so like this, and over here, and, and, and add white to it too, because the farther away things get, the lighter they get, the, the lighter. So I'm gonna add some more white, I'm gonna get into this white. Let me show y'all. Get into this white, put it on my brush. Look how beautiful this is starting to come up. And I'm just gonna make these little trees all in the background. Yeah. And then sometimes you can curve them over like that. 
You can curve them out. You know, like that. And so the baby trees, don't forget about them. You see, hidden mommies add barks on the tip of them. Like, just come up and turn them into V's. Just turn them into V's on this side and on the other side. Don't forget, trees got branches on both sides, all sides. So just uh, break them out like so, right? So you gotta put you gotta put branches on them because trees are just not things to stick out of the ground. So I'm, I'm, I have a reference photo here. I'm just really just doing what I want. I'm just doing what I want. And you could do what you want too. See, you see it, sissy? Mm -hmm. So yeah, you just add as many trees as you want and don't make them all straight. Crickety, crickety, crickety lines, crickety lines, crickety line trees. Now we did our straight trees, let's do some crickety line trees. Yeah, and then put branches on them, all right? Crickety lines, and just go back and forth. Now, I think that that might be a lot of trees. We could put more in there. I don't know. What do you guys want to do? All right, over here, I see on the picture that it's got a lot more, so I'm just going to add a lot more trees over here in this area okay and then look this one comes down further we got these trees on the hill so so now now you can bring some trees to sit on the hill and and you could you, we've been working with our brush straight like this you could turn it this way and make a bigger tree watch watch we'll come right here we'll start right here and I'm going to lay this brush down, and I'm going to make an even bigger tree. Like that. And then once it gets higher, you just let it go up there. Now we got a bigger tree. See? Now, the thing about it is, trees at the bottom, they don't snap me in the ground like poles. They have roots. So just make the big paint in the brush and come out and do like this. It's okay. Don't worry about that. Yeah, there you go. Come on here. You can do this one too. Just a little V at the bottom. Just a little bit. And then, you know, woo -woo -woo. okay? All right. So now we got some trees with roots at the bottom and you can make little marks going on the side if you choose to or you could just let your paintbrush do what it wants, okay? All right? So we look at now. It appears that the sun is out. It's blinging through the trees. We have some trees in the background way back there that's got leaves on them. That's what it looked like. All right. We got a pathway that goes through. All right. So now what we want to do is we want to fill these trees up with leaves because they are not on the ground there. We just still got a lot of trees. Look at this picture. Still got a lot of trees. So this is what I want y'all to do. I want you to start getting into your yellows and your oranges. It's okay if you got a little brown on your brush. It's still cool. I didn't tell you to rinse, so just start putting in little tiny dabs. Little tiny dabs everywhere. Yeah, just put them in everywhere, you guys. Just start popping them in. And it's okay if your paint is a little thicker because when things is closer, they become more 3D. You can ask unbiased LLC about 3D. She likes 3Ds a lot, you guys. So, you know, and then you can make little stripes in there. For your little tiny branches, little streaks like this. You could do it, just do it, just do it. Little tiny branches, and just make little streaks going around like that. And just add more leaves. You can go to a smaller brush. Let's do that, you guys. Let's just dump that brush in the water. Don't rinse it, though. Just go ahead and grab your smaller brush. You know, um, if you got a detail brush, oh, yeah, if you got a detail brush, that's cool. If you got a little small brush, like a little tiny brush, a little tiny one, go ahead and grab that thing. Yeah. All right, let's get into it. Start dabbing any color you want. But just start dabbing. Dab it, dab it, dab it. Even white. Add some white in there, too. And some greens. Yeah, you might want to break that green up, though, with some orange or something. But it's okay if you put it out there. Let's get into it. More orange, more yellow, more reds. Just go ahead and put it everywhere. And let it start mixing because these turn brown, you guys, okay? They do turn brown. So if you get brown on your brush, don't get upset. 
the fine adds to the auto flare. And so just start dipping, 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 all over, all over the place, okay? Now, y'all see something starting to happen? All right, come on, family. Let's talk about it. What's my time stamp, sis? It is 103. 103. We've been on here one hour. But a lot of it was dancing and playing and having fun. So let's go. We're going to keep on dabbing. We're going to pick up the pace. Let's pick it up, y'all. Let's pick it up. Let's start dabbing harder and more. But don't cover it all up now, just a little bit. And start dabbing and dabbing and dabbing. All right, I want to get some more horns on my breast and, and some more yellow on my palette, okay? So I'm going to do it. I'm going to grab some. And I'm going to put some out so I'm working with primarily orange to yellow to red. All right, excuse me, sniffles. So, and I'm going to add a little white in there here and there because some, some leaves are lighter than others, okay? Some leaves are lighter than others, so I'll just add a little mixture in there, and I'm going to just start dabbing and dabbing and just dabbing. That's it. Just keep going. And you can do this as much as you want, okay? If you want to get a bigger brush out, then that's up to you. But I like the little brush because these little dabs, is really representing leaves, right? Check me out, Sandy Cheek. How you like it now? Yeah, yeah. So look, you guys, just keep dabbing and keep pushing. Keep pushing and dabbing. Yeah, that's what you need to do. And you always mm -hmm. can come back and watch the replay if you forget something or if you want to see me do something different that you didn't see the first time. Come on in and watch the replay. That is what I'm here for, you guys. I'm here to show you everything that I know. I might not know everything, but I'll tell you what. What I do know, I'm going to show you. If you want to get a little bit of that brown in there, kids, you can dab. Huh? Some of the kids, the chat is loving it. The chat is loving it, kids. Yeah. Okay, let's go, pal. And so, yeah, you can get a little swipe on it if you want to. If you just want to feel artistic, you can do that. All right? So, yeah. Now. Because we're closing up on a one hour mark, and I promise you guys that you could do this in an hour. I'm going to let you go ahead and just keep dabbing. Now, don't overdo it, you guys. Give all the trees some leaves and give all the trees curvatures, you know, to make them look real, okay? And don't forget to add a very little bit amount of green in there because it is green. If you have burgundy paint, go ahead and do it. Whatever is mixing up on your brush, feel free to put it on here because, you guys, I'm trying to tell you, it makes a really big difference to add all these colors in for fall. This is one of the beauties of fall. So you're just going to keep adding in and don't leave any part unturned. Make sure you get in there and get it all together. I'm going to add a little bit of brown on my brush for back in here. Just a little bit. If you want to get this, um, oh, they got a hole. <laughs> I'm painted in a hole, you guys. But it, do we care? Do we care? Come on, Carl. All right, so we're just going to get into it. And I'm just going to scrub my brush a little bit because we're down here on the ground. And I'm just going to make sure I represent maybe a bush or two. There's bushes out here, too, so you can go up and down. Just go in there and scrub around and just make it kind of look just blew it out, basically, you know, and just make it look pretty. And keep pushing, keep pushing. No matter what you are facing in your life every day, always remember to keep pushing. If it's something, a goal that you're trying to reach, because you can do it. All right, you guys. I just want you to know that it is easy to do this painting. This painting is a representation of something that you may have thought was very hard to do. And it turned out not to be so hard at all. All you had to do was get the proper instruction and want to do it. And that's it. That's how, that's how you got to do it. That's how you got to take life. And sometimes it don't work out for you all the time. You, you Everything's not going to go your way. Everything's not going to go the way you planned it. That's true. But you gave it a try. And that's the important part. Okay? And now I don't want you ever forget that. I don't want you to forget that. So when you feel like the urge of something is overgrowing or you want to streak something up, go ahead and streak it up. It's okay. 
Just do what you want to do. It doesn't even have to look like the picture because we don't know where this picture was taken at. We don't care. We're making our own outside. We outside, y'all. Okay? Making our own outside. And it's healthy. It's healthy to use your imagination and not always go on what you see other people do. Okay? The reason why I use reference photos a lot for you guys is because um, I want us all to have the same image and I want people who did not get it, if they didn't ask me for it, if they decided to do it at the last minute, I wanted them to be able to, to have access to the picture. So if we are using the same picture and they can get it off Google, it'll make it easier for them. So that's why I did it, to help others, okay? So, yeah, if I drew these out on my own and had them here in my house, how would everybody get them if I'm trying to paint with you guys? Other people might want them. Okay, so you can just look it up online. So, yeah, I just want you guys to start adding in a little bit more white in here now, which is yellow, just to lighten things up a little bit here and there. It's okay, and just dab. I think we we, we about did what we're going to do over here. Um, this tree, I like it. I could add a little bush or something down here and make it seem like it's just coming off there. Maybe some more of it back up in here. Just to give it some interest or whatever it's going to have you. I like seeing a lot of sky through here. The leaves are down. They're coming down. And, I, and you just can dab until you feel happy. When you feel happy and you look at your art and you say, I'm happy. Then you finished. You sign it. Okay? So, I know you guys saying, well, what's going on over here? I know. I know. I know. As you can see on the photo, it's a big tree. I want it. You know why I want this tree so bad? I want this tree so bad. Let's put the ground in first. We're just going to take some orange, maybe some of that red color. We're going to dab it in. I'm almost out of the red. Now I don't want to put any more down. So I'm just going to scrape my palette. And I'm just going to add it in and just dab. And dab all around here, too, so you can make it seem like it's some tree leaves that have fell down, Okay. It's just some yellow and stuff. And just dab it on in there. Just dab it in. Guys, don't be afraid. All right? Now, over here, though, I want to kind of squish it around a little bit. Just kind of a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit. Just get some white in there. To just squish it around just a little bit. Just a little something, something. Put some of it over here, too. So don't look dark. You'll say, why well, is over there and it ain't over here? Ooh, look. We can put maybe a leaf or two on, a, on our pathway. Okay? Just drop some on there. Just drop some on there. Just dab it. Okay, back over here. Back over here. All right, so we're going to do this. So now I want to get a little bit more brown, and I'm going to put some down in here. Yeah, we're just going to drop some brown and stuff. We've got to squish it around, though. Don't just squish it around a little bit. Just put some down there and squish it around like that. Yeah, just all on the pathway and then like that. When you see a little squirrel run past, don't be afraid because that's where they live. They live out here. Okay, so now, y'all see the tree? We're going to put this tree right here. And why we left it for last is because big things are always in the front. So all this stuff is behind now. So now we're going to take the biggest brush we have, which for me today, I mean, I really have really super big brush like this. Okay, look how big this brush is to that one. I got even bigger one, but you may not. So I'm not going to use... I'm not going to, uh, not cheat, but I'm not going to take advantage of my tools. And you guys probably have something this side. So the biggest brush that you have in there, a flat brush, okay, just like this. We don't care if it's paint still on it. Remember, we just dumped it in our bucket, but we didn't rinse. Yeah. Now get into that brown. Remember the brown we made or you might have? Just go ahead and grab it. Fill it up on your brush. Now, mine is really thick because it's a burnt umber. And it's like a charcoal. It's very thick. Okay? And, and so I'm just going to dab it, dab it, dab your brush around in there. Really good. Okay? And we're going to double load it. We're going to take our brush and swoop it up this way. Then flip our brush over on the side and swoop it up this way too. So now that we have paint on both sides of our brush, this side and that side. And I want you guys to come right here. At the bottom of your canvas, okay? We're going to leave room. 
because we want to put the tree roots in. So we'll start about right there, a little bit higher, like about an inch off the canvas, okay? And you take your breath. I want you to go straight up. All the way. If you ran out of paint on it, that's okay. Now flip it over on the other side. You go right next to that and drag that all the way up. It's okay if it's crooked and make it straight. Honey, don't worry about that. Now go up and down with it. You will see colors from the leaves that you already painted that's going to start blending in with the tree. <laughs> it's okay, baby. Don't worry about it. Okay? Go ahead and just bring it all the way down. Now, just go up back and forth, up and down, just like that. Yeah? You're doing it. See? Look. You're doing it. Okay. So Tina now we got this tree in there. Beautiful. Huh? Tina said it sure is beautiful. Thank you, Tina. I appreciate that. See? Tina's saying it's beautiful, you guys. And that means that adults is liking it, okay? Because they're going to be like, oh, they're they going to want to pinch your cheeks. So be careful. Don't get too close to them. They don't get too close to their adults now. Now load your brush back up again, huh? Which, they, right, right. Stay back. Stay back. Be like, mom, dad, I want to show you something. Stay back. And then you say, nigga, say, what do you mean stay back? He say, hey, stay back, please. I want to show you something. So just load up as much paint as you can on your brush. All right? Now, this time I want you to dip it in some water. Okay? Knock the water off. Don't rinse. Just dip it in the water. Now, I want you to come back in here, and I want you to drag this tree up again from the bottom. Oh, I, I'm sorry. And then let's start from the top for me. So I'm sitting side of it. So from the top and bring it on down. And it's okay if it's squiggly line. Don't worry about it. Let's go from the top and bring it on down. Yeah, there you go, family. Now go on and brush it in. Don't forget the top of your painting. You want the tree to go all the way up. All right? And if you want to go on the side, you can. Now, when you get up here to the top, drag it all the way down. Look at me. Look at me. Dragging it all the way down. Now putting pressure on my brush. So when I get to the bottom, guess what I'm going to do? Guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to take it and fan it out to the side like that. See? Just fan it out to the side. And fan this out to the side. When you get down here, fan it out to the side. Yeah, just make a little marks on the side. Like make it like, it, like a tree. All right? A tree that got deep rooted. Right? And then don't forget to paint your sides, babies. Always paint your sides. Okay, because we want this tree to look like it's the biggest thing in the forest. All right, I'm getting paint on the reference photo now. All right, I'm being silly. All right, let me just grab it off and show you what I'm doing. I'm dipping my paint in water, my brush in water if I need to. And I'm just coming back with it wet. I'm just wet, man, and just bring it back and dragging that paint because we already painted it once or twice. So this this is just more like a glaze. And look at that tree. And you can just fool with it. You run it down, run it down in there. Yeah, it doesn't have to be the same color all the way down. No, we could just make sure it's even and it's been there for a long time and it's beautiful. Now, dip the same brush. This is the finale. Dip the same brush, get you a little white in there, a little yellow in there, a little orange in there. Get all them colors and just come in at the bottom and dab. Just dab. This dab and dab the tree bottom, and then add more to any other place that you feel like you need to. Okay, you can add with this brush and just kind of do 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 do, and then put it in the water. Grab the tiniest brush that you have, detail brush time, y'all. Let's go on and sign this thing. I think I want to sign that with some white. I'm feeling white. Nice. But it's got like all kind of colors blended in. So I don't care. It's making it like a gold look at. And so I'm just gonna dip my brush in there. I got it nice and wet. And so now the paint is fluid. They're gonna do what I want. And guess what I'm gonna put in there? Y'all already know. I'm gonna put in Auntie Carmen. Yeah, yeah, because this what I, this what we did. So I'm gonna grab it. And I think I wanna go right here at the bottom of this tree root. You don't have to. You can do it wherever you want. But this is where I want to write my name. So I'm going, can you all see me write my name? Okay, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, get that A in there. U N T 
And if your paint starts to run out, get you some more. T. And I like two E's on my IT. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm all that. In a bag of chips. Auntie. And I make 755. Now I'm going to do it underneath. 755. Oh, I got a little sloppy right there. <laughs> oh, girl. Look, you guys. What are you thinking over there, Auntie Cuddles? Yeah, I think we did beautiful today. You guys can do it. Everybody can do it. And it was fun, right? Okay, it was fun. Auntie Cuddle had jokes for you guys. I want you all to get ready to get... Uh, got you got another joke? All right, well, you go ahead. I'm about to get myself ready to stretch it out, honey, because I've been singing for hours. Yeah, and I want to stretch a little bit. Go ahead, tell us your okay. joke. Why did the apple pie cross the road? Why did the apple pie cross the road? To get in my belly. <laughs> yeah. Good one. Yeah. It saw a fork up ahead. It saw a fork up ahead. That. Now I can just look at our paint right now and see a whole <laughs> apple pie crossing the road so it can get to the fork up ahead. Okay. Y'all look at this. This isn't it gorgeous. Isn't it nice? I am so proud of you guys. I'm trying to tell you. When you show the adults this one, they're gonna be like, where that just kidding lady at? I need I need to, I need her to teach me how to paint. Okay. Hey, look, look, kids. Don't be selfish. Okay, if they want to paint with me, let them paint with me. Let them paint. Just let them know, hey, I'll share my paints with you. You don't have to buy me some more. Just let them know that, okay? But I'm telling you, the adults is going to love this because they think all you want to do is paint cartoons. But on this channel, we paint cartoons. We paint real things, too. Okay? So, basically, let everybody know. Let everybody know. Auntie, Auntie Carmen, Auntie 755, is paint every Saturday, 12 high noon. All right, so let's stretch out, you guys. Oh, I want to put some music on first. Uh, 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 let me get over here. Y'all know what I like to play? Y'all already know what I like to play when we exercise and work out. Yeah, I like them ducks. You guys like it. It's called feeding ducks. All right, so stretch your arms all the way out as far as you can get them. Pull, pull, your, pull your palms up. Pull your palms up on your hands like this. Yeah, just like this. And then when you're stretching out, I want you to kind of just... Bend, your, bend backwards a little bit. Feel it in your back, all right? Just feel it in your back a little bit. And you can move your neck around. Now, I want to tell you, if you're not able to do it, and if it hurts to do it, don't do it, okay? I want you to hurt yourself. I just want you to stretch out because it's not good to sit in the chair for a long time and not get up and walk around and stretch out. We've been sitting here for an hour. So let's get into it. Do the best you can, okay? But do not hurt yourself. All right? And don't punch your big brother in the eye. Just... Politely, put your arms out. And I want you to just tap at the. Oh, my balloon is here. I get sidetracked by balloons. Anyway, yeah, just kind of wiggle your arms around like this. And you like you like you're just hopping around in the forest. In the picture we paint, just you hopping along that path. You see the birds and the trees. The squirrels hopping around. You know the nuts. You know that nuts. It's that gagging and nuts. And then you just float it around. Like I just painted this picture and I'm in it. Yeah, just have fun. Use your imagination, okay? Now I want you to do this. Yeah, let's get into it. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now reach all the way up to the sky. The tallest tree you painted. Reach and touch the tallest tree that you painted, all right? Just reach up there and stretch. And don't forget to do what? Smile. Yeah. Smile on. All right? Because you did a great job. I'm so happy you came. I'm so happy I came today. You know, instead of just hanging out and watching the kids outside playing, I'd rather paint with you. Yeah. Every Saturday. Don't forget every Saturday. I ain't going to let y'all down. I'll be here, all right? 
even if it's a video, I'm be here for y'all. So I want you guys to know that. I want you to make sure that each and every one of you grab your paints, put your tops on tight, okay? Make sure you take your brushes, rinse them out real good at the sink. Ah, ah, slow down. No running. Just take the uh, water to the sink, clean the brushes out really good, wipe them off and dry them with your towel so they'll be ready for next week. All right? Same thing with your palette. If you need an art kit, ask your parents to email me. My email is on the screen. It's been scrolling all off the afternoon. My email is in my description here on the channel. And so if you need a box, Go ahead and get it. All right. Uh, I'll tell you more about how to uh about the giveaway and how I'm going to choose a giveaway. Uh, I'll do that a little bit later. Uh closer probably around Thanksgiving. Uh next up on our painting probably will be. I'm thinking about a turkey, sissy. I don't know. What do you think? Oh, wait a minute. Auntie Carlos was ready for the turkey. She had, um, turkey with dressing. Well, real turkey. Double turkey. Double turkey. So you want me to paint a tur regular turkey and then the turkey with dressing? Well, I want you to paint the regular turkey and then make some turkey and dressing. Oh, she said paint the regular turkey and then go make some turkey and dressing. I don't know. Maybe cornucopia, you know what I'm saying? Something Ooh, like that. That would be nice. That would be nice. Uh, we like to uh, paint fruits and vegetables around here. It was probably about time we do th did that. Maybe the yeah. cornucopia. And we want to pay homage to all of our harvesting friends all the friends that i know that like to plant and it's harvest time and they're out there harvesting all their stuff and just because so we can eat good you know so um whether you have something in the garden at home or whether you're a big farmer that manufactures and ride those big tractors and manufactures and harvest wheat or corn or whatever you do shout out gonna be to you we're gonna do a cornucopia okay so look out for that if you need it the um if you need the reference photo, please email me, okay? Just know we're going to put our own little twist on things. And what else, sis, you need to tell them? Oh, yeah, all your jokes are sponsored by Accessory. Make sure y'all go out and reapply. Accessory got the new fall edition now, okay? So make sure y'all, I might need to reapply right now. I ain't reapplied the whole program. Yeah, let me put some on. Let me just see it. Yeah, there you go. Ah, uh, bam. Mm -mm -mm. All right. So, I guess that's about it. I know there's one more thing I had to tell y'all. Uh, let me see what's on here for me to tell y'all. Sometimes I got a list of stuff. Um, well, shout out to everybody over at 755 Media, all the adults. Shout out to everybody who made Super Chats today. I'm talking Four Corners Custom Products, Mobile Alabama, Big Boy Prince, yeah, Casper Creations. What I miss? That's it? Mm -hmm. Okay. I right, make sure. Okay. It was a little tight. And shout out for us, uh, our, our people who make this program what it is. All my moderators and all my huns. I appreciate everybody. And mostly I appreciate you kids. And I guess that's about it. Anything you want to tell the people? They deserve it. Yeah, she said it. You deserve art. Yeah, kids do. I'm 755 Media, also known as IT755. This has been a great broadcast. Thank you for watching. And just remember, you can do it. You can. I love y'all. Peace. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. It's hot noon. Draw. Set up, set up, set up. Get ready, get ready, get ready. IT755 is here. The wait is over.
figures too. We're pain slaves, we slain the pain, create our masterpiece. We're cracking jokes, we're stretching out, we do this every week. We paint real things, and sometimes cartoons. Drop down our tarps and meet at high noon. Other kids are outside, but we're in our zone. We just want to paint with Auntie 755 cell. Oh, yeah.